the second thing is, is that we have the new Midas printer that just came out this year. Uh, is, this video is being created in 2025. Uh, it, when it came out, it allows us to print three separate crowns in eight minutes or three, uh, three sets of, of, of three, uh, basically nine veneers in, in, nine, in eight minutes. And so this technology is a game changer because I can, I can place a dental implant, I can scan it, and then I can design and print a, a crown, a non-functional provisional within minutes and screw it right into the mouth without having to make any adjustments to contacts. Zenith height looks great, contacts look great, and the patient's wearing a beautiful temporary until they're done healing. And remember, we've said it a number of times on the show, maintain, not regain. What we want to do is we want to maintain the hard and soft tissue around that extraction socket, and there's no better way than doing that than placing an implant, gap grafting, and then placing a non-functional provisional to socket seal everything in place and to hold that tissue. Well, we used to do that with a prefabricated provisional using the Stanley S-Wings, right? And I thought, wow, this is great. And like I said, the technology moves so fast. We only invented that a couple years ago. It's already obsolete because now we have a printer that can print in eight minutes. So why would I, why would I uh, fabricate a prefabricated crown, which might need a few adjustments to make it perfect, and it's never quite perfect, it's close, versus just scan it chair side right after you place the implant, scan it, and in a matter of minutes, you have a perfectly fitting provision.